Uh, this topic is to introduce you the two-way table. What is a two-way table? A two-way table is used to describe the relationship between two qualitative variables. Not qualitative, qualitative variable. A two-way table, sometimes also called a, a contingency table. Or some people just call this is a cross tabulation. Okay, a cross tabulation. Okay, also called a, a cross tabulation. For example, to understand what is a two-way table and what we can use it for, uh, let's look at the uh, following example. A social scientist wanted to study the relationship between gender, we call X, and promotion status, Y, of a local private company. She summarized the corrected data as follows. Okay, let's look at the table really quickly. Okay, um, here X is gender. Gender is a column variable. This is a column, male, female. So gender is a column variable. Promotion status is what we call low variable, which is Y. Okay, yes or no. Okay. Yes or no? Uh, let's look at what is yes, what is no. Yes, if the selected person got promoted in the last three years, okay, we say yes. No is what? Otherwise, if the selected person did not get any promotion in the last three years, we call what? No. And look at here, both variable X and Y are qualitative. They are not qualitative, they are qualitative, okay? They are qualitative. Now, Um, X is a low variable and Y is a column variable, as you can see from the two-way table. And the distribution of the variable. When we say distribution of the variable, when we say distribution of variable, two information need to be well specified. And what are the two? Let's see. When we say distribution of variable, we should tell people A. What are the possible values? And then B, how likely or how often or how often? Do we see that? Okay. When we say distribution available, we need to tell people how likely or how often we see them, okay? 